hey guys thank you so much for all you do i appreciate you guys you guys are the best thank you for all you do thank you for attracting new subscribers to my channel you guys are the best i really love you so much and don't forget this is saffron media and we are in the business of giving you the latest the hottest most reliable and authentic news as it drops by the hour and right here and now we have another very interesting news it is coming from edo state don't forget that the edo gubernatorial primary is um very close and uh, there's been a lot of um speculations that have been going on between uh Ize Iyamu and the uh, governor of edo state obaseki and um, right now another one is coming from uh the, the leader of APC, that is um, Tinubu Bola Hamed, he has asked Oshomole to um, pick Ige Iyamu as, I Ize Iyamu as um, the consensus candidate. But before we go details into this news, hey guys, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? We are a family because we give you the best and the hottest news. Hit that subscribe button right away. And also please like this video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and also share this video and hit the notification bell so you'll be the first to get notified anytime we drop a new video come on guys let's go details into the news ahead of the Edo 2020 All Progressive Congress APC governorship primary election to pick its candidate. The campaign organization of Pastor Osage Ize Iyamu, who is an aspirant yesterday said it has exposed plots to cause disaffection among aspirants of the ABC. A statement by the campaign organization said some persons have been have been paid to sponsor articles and other media contents against aspirants seeking the ticket of the All Progressive Congress, including the, res the respected former deputy governor of Edo State, Dr. Pius Odubu, engineer Chris Ogiemoyi. And General Charles Awiabare retired. Pastor Osage Ize Iyamu, among others, this article were products of a campaign hashed by those seeking to cause disaffection and disunity amongst the aspirants who are jointly committed to the ultimate objective of returning Edo State back on the path of great growth and development after four years of this, this uh, misadventure. So oh, I hope that is what the Edo State people want because it seems uh, APC have their own agenda of who they want to be the uh, a governor of Edo State. But um, we know God has uh, his best for Edo State. But meanwhile, the director of communication of, of the campaign organization, John Mayaki, who called on the state government to leave the national chairman of the party, Comrade Adams Oshomole, alone just as it said there was no mini congress in the state as being reported earlier the state government has as has through a paid advertorial accused Oshomole of not putting into the consideration ravaging covid 19 and brought together to organize a mini primary election purportedly to pick a candidate that would slug it out with Je governor godwin or baseki to get the party's ticket uh, he said this, that since the outbreak of COVID-19 in Nigeria, Comrade Adams Oshomole has adhered strictly to all measures announced by the government and presidential tax force charged with the management of the viral disease. He has also joined efforts with progressive across the country to offer relief to the Nigerian people and generate pragmatic ideas that can help the country return to normalcy in the shortest time possible without endangering lives. It is neither a constitutional duty for the national chairman of a party to conduct mock primaries, nor something Comrade Adams Oshomole has ever done in his long history in politics. Those at the said meeting, the Edo state government dubbed a mock primary, has since offered a rebuttal, showing evidence that the meeting held in observance of social distancing guidelines, according to them, was done to articulate ways to support the Edo state government in the fight 
against COVID-19 following widespread complaints from residents of the state. So guys, you've heard it. Uh, Adam Sushomole, um, Godwin Obaseki, Ige Iyamo, Ize Iyamo, uh, are all planning for uh, a new Edo state. Do you think the ticket should be for Ize Iyamo or it should go to Obaseki? Because um, the reports we've been gathering is that um, Godwin Obaseki has been doing really well for the people of Edo state. And we still hope that he becomes the next governor of Edo state. But it seems the APC government, the APC party, does not want him to continue as the governor of Edo state. The APC leader actually wants uh, um, the chairman of APC to pick a consensus candidate. And the same, the consensus candidate he really wants right now is Ize Iyamo. But what has Obaseki done that um, Bola Ahmed Tinubu does not want him to represent the party in a dual state? And there's been a rift between Adam Soshiomole and uh, Godwin Obaseki of a dual state. And that is not yet resolved. And now the leader of the APC has also come to say a consensus candidate should be picked. And he has not even picked Godwin Obaseki. Please tell us your thoughts about this. Do you think the APC are in the right track? Do you think what they are doing is right? Or do you think Godwin Obaseki is the right candidate for Edo State or Ize Iyamo? Please don't forget to drop your comments. Don't forget to give this video a like. And hey, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? If you are new to this channel, come on, hit the subscribe button. And also, hit the notification bell so you'll be the first to get notified anytime we drop a new video. Thank you guys for staying tuned. I love you so much. Don't forget to save and have fun. Bye.